Let's take a closer look at this accident or claim. Assume your insured is the gray vehicle second in line in this three car accident. The driver of the white car stated they were stopped for a red traffic light and was suddenly hit from behind by your insured. Your insured stated they came to a stop behind the white car. Moments later, the yellow car hit them from behind and pushed them into the car in front of them. The driver of the yellow car stated they were driving behind your insured at about 20 miles per hour. They said your insured ran into the back of the white car so suddenly that they had no time to react and as a result, ran into the back of your insured. There are no witnesses and the driver's statements are in complete conflict. Is this looking like a shared liability claim to you? Let's watch what really happened. As you can see, your insured came to a complete stop behind the white car with no incident. The yellow car comes in from behind, hits your insured, and pushes your insured into the back of the white car. You don't have this video, but with the Bosch CDR tool, your claims investigator can image the EDR data from your insured's vehicle. Two separate events or impacts were retrieved and are contained in the CDR report. This is consistent with what we know about the accident. The data page for the first impact indicates your insured had been stopped with the brakes applied before being hit. At impact, your insured's vehicle experienced a positive or forward acceleration of approximately 10 miles per hour, indicating it was struck from behind. The data page for the second impact shows your insured's vehicle abruptly went from 0 to 8 miles per hour from being pushed forward by the yellow car. It then experienced a sudden deceleration of approximately 7 miles per hour, which was the result of it hitting the back of the white car. Comparing the EDR data contained in the CDR report with the known details of the accident clearly indicates that your insured had come to a complete stop, was struck from behind, and was propelled into the car in front of it. So what did EDR data do for your claim settlement? Without the EDR data, you likely would have paid for your insured's property loss and bodily injury and 50% of the white car's property loss and bodily injury. With the EDR data, you were able to absolve yourself of liability and subrogate it to the true at-fault party.